do you think I look like Humphrey Bogart? No. Well, you see, that's interesting because I'm a big film buff. Bogart was the best, the king. When I was in the joint, there was a movie producer who was in there with me, and I, I says to him, I says, do you think I look like Humphrey Bogart? And he says, well, yeah, you do, but a stretched out version of him. <laughs> It's a fantastic story. You're actually really fucking hot, you know? Well, you're a pretty cute kid yourself. You look like the sort of gent who might have a big Johnny pistol in the trunk or on the front seat. It's under the front seat. All right, I'll take that pistol. So Greco tells me you're a heavy guy. <laughs> I'm not referring to your weight. I mean that apparently you are a gentleman of some power and influence. Yeah, well, I try my best. It is a shitty economy out there, so we all got to work overtime all the time. I heard that. Right. I don't follow. He has like a Mexican mom and an Irish dad, and he's totally Latin looking dude, so that was British. It was you. Me? On the TV, the shootout. Yes, but it wasn't like they say. Well, how was it? You ever been inside, Reverend, in the joint? Yes, sir. Well, then you know. Guy who has a past, guys made mistakes. They say they forgive you, but they never do. They're always looking at you, trying to catch you at something. All we want, heck, all anybody wants is justice. I was explaining to the officer and she she panicked. She thought I was resisting. Yeah, that's right, resisting. And my friend was just trying to save me. Nah, I'll get us a real good gig. I'll get us such a good gig. Take a tits off. <laughs>